Hey everyone, it's Libby from Meister Tarot. I'd like to acknowledge the Waramai First Nations people, the traditional custodians of the land on which these videos are made, and welcome to you, your guides, my guides, and the universal energies. Yes, I'm back from the trip away. Um, was was despite the reason, was a lovely catch up with family. And I spent this morning down at the beach with uh, my little 18 month old granddaughter. So if I look like I was being, looked like something that the cat dragged in, yeah, it was, yeah, I got sand everywhere. Um, yeah, and goodness me, the weather is warming up. Uh, we're only in August, which is not even technically spring, although, you know, the change of seasons is a gradual process. Um, but yeah, beautiful, glorious day out there today. Okay, entertainment only. What I want to have a look at is, um, oh, first of all, absolutely thrilled to see the uh, opening statement. I haven't seen it, but I've heard of it, heard that it happened. The First Nations Acknowledgement, the Indigenous American, North American Acknowledgement at the DNC. Australia's been doing this for years and years and years, but it's absolutely goodness me. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, what I want to have a look at is Trump's attorney has filed um, for uh, Judge Michonne to delay sentencing until after the election. The decision is Judge Michonne's to make. And boy, I tell you what, he's not, he is in no frame of mind to do any favours for Donald Trump. So I'm going to have a look to see how Judge Michonne is going to rule on that. And I can just about, actually, I'm just being told it's going to be a no from Michonne. I haven't seen Trump being uh, imprisoned. Uh, I do feel that he's going to have, actually, this is really interesting. I'm seeing it's not Mar-a-Lago. I see he's going to have like a home confinement type thing. I don't think he's going to have an ankle monitor or anything put on him. But he's going to be ordered into home detention and I'm getting Bedminster. Is, I think that's the one at New Jersey, is it? It's Or is it Silver? What's it called? Silver Springs or something like that. He's going to, uh, not at Mar-a-Lago, uh, and not in the New York apartment either. He's going to be ordered to home detention and he will be, oh, he's going to complain like you wouldn't believe. He's going to be free to campaign and to travel, etc. but he has to put in a, what I'm getting is he's going to have to put in a, um, like the week before, he's going to have to let his probation officer know and it's going to have to be approved. He is going to B-I-T-C-H like nobody's business about it and claim, just like he has with the gag order, claiming that he can't talk. Oh, yes, he can. The gag order basically says he can't um, uh, uh, attack um, the court Judge Michonne's court staff, the jurors, or any family members not associated with the court case, so ergo uh, the judge's daughter or, or family of any of the witnesses, etc. That's all that gag order does, tells him he can't do that. But he's out there complaining that he can't, he's been stopped from talking at all. Oh, yeah, no, he's not. And this particular home detention, he's going to, oh, you know what he's like. Anyhow, what I want to have a look at, uh, let's have a look. So show me, show me, is Judge Michonne going to delay? No, I don't think he's going to. Uh, I think he's going to let the swords fall and move this case forward. So sentencing, I believe, is the 18th of September, uh, two days after Judge Michonne, um, while Michonne will make a ruling on the immunity. I don't see it uh, being delayed at all. So let's have a look. Will Trump's New York voter interference, whatever you like to call it, business documents, fudging, the New York, Judge Michonne's New York case, will it get delayed at all? Will there be any delay? I know I could pull pendulum out for a simple yes or no, but we do like the longer story. Um, I'm using my gilded tarot royale if anyone is interested in the decks. So let's have a look. Will it be delayed? Temperance. Ah. Uh, it is very much about balancing fire and water. 
uh, it is try it is um, fi finding a balance. So okay, is it going to be delayed? I don't feel it feel it will be, but Judge Michonne is going to try and find a balance here. Challenged by uh, three cups are spilt and emotionally walking away or walking too. So we've got the uh, the feminine moon here. The, okay, thank you. Um, right, I just got told what this card means. Thank you very much. Love it when my boys come through. Uh, the emo the challenge for Michonne is going to be uh, the emotional loss and lunacy. So this is what he's going to try have to try and balance is the is the uh, emotional um, lunacy that's going to come out from a certain element. We know who that's going to be. That's what he's going to have to try and balance. Is it going to be delayed? So at the foundation, we have the lover's cup. It is about the um, fading of the toxic masculine energy. And this card also means uh, just by pouring back and forth is dispelling of toxicity. Two major arcana, though, they're usually a yes. So, um, hmm, let's see how they go. Uh, the fading of the masculine as the uh, we've got this rise of this um, compassionate energy. In the past, we've got the mercenary actions all about the money. Well, this is the case itself in the past. Crowning this reading, the infighting, the bickering back and forth, uh, filing more motions. So, okay, there's some infighting going on here, some back and forth, some argy-bargy push and shove. The immediate future. The world card and ending and significant beginning here, ending something in a and a significant new chapter, ending the case perhaps. Hmm, let's see where this goes. Externally, we've got uh, it's my card for Harris. Now Walls is not the King of Swords. Kings, um, I haven't actually decided on a card for Walls yet. Um, basically, you can't because the king is a higher ranking than the queen. He can't be the king of swords. Um, okay, thank you. I'm getting more that queens are internally doing, whereas kings are externally taking action. This is him, Judge Michon, contemplating the legalities of it all externally. Uh, banishment out in the cold. Is it going to be delayed externally, internally? He's trying to, he's real, I'm getting, he's really conflicted about what decision to make. Okay, I might get pendulum in a moment. Uh, hopes and fears, again, end of a cycle for him, a lot of fines, going to be a lot of fines for Trump. Here's this vascular event I keep getting, the outcome, the vascular event, ill health, and an important decision that needs to be made. And a, a two of cups as well. Decisions need to be made uh, legally and emotionally in the face of smoke and mirrors and poor choices, but also an emotional breakdown. That will be very public. Okay. We've got Page of Swords here bringing forth an, this new uh, legal angle, an offer being made that is unpleasant. But we've got the complete and utter downfall. And here's Michonne himself taking advice bringing forward something unexpected out of left field, page of pentacles, bringing forth um, a, a solution. We've got strength, we've got death. 
a significant ending of a cycle, a new beginning with the Fool card, the Knight of Cups, the offer being brought forward in regards to Trump, the Emperor. Okay, I'm going to leave that there and I'll grab Pendulum. I'm wondering whether Trump's going to have his health event prior to. For those that are new, this is an amethyst that's been with me for gosh, 25 odd years. A bit of wire from the craft shop and a chain from my drawer. Show me yes, show me yes, back and forth. Can you show me no, please? Show me no. Show me no, side to side. Okay, round and round means it's ready for a question. Can I ask a question, please? Is Donald Trump going to either have or appear to have a health event prior to, straight into the yes, prior to sentencing? Straight into the yes, and it's a big yes. Because I've only got a short chain here at the moment. Usually I have it longer. Okay, is this going to affect Mershon's sentencing? Straight into a yes. Am I right that Trump is going to have some form of home detention? And that's... It's sort of, it's angle to angle. Is Donald Trump going to be restricted to home? Yes. Is his movements, is Donald Trump's movements going to be report, have to be reported to the courts? Yes. Okay, so what I'm getting, okay, thank you, that's really strange. What I'm getting is that he's going to have some sort of health event. Oh, goodness me, don't <laughs> touch wood. Um, some sort of health event prior to the sentencing. Thank goodness me. And then where was that Ace of Cups with the emotional breakdown as well? And this one as well. It feels like he's going to have some sort of health event prior to. Now, whether it's a real health event or a pretend, entertainment only, to try and wriggle out, Judge Michonne will have to make that decision, but I think what will happen is that he will then be, as part of it, confined. Um, okay, thank you. So I'm getting the sentencing will be more that, okay, thank you. What um, Michonne will be uh, doing is that if Trump wants to, confined if he wants to travel he has to let his probation officer know prior and have it approved to short circuit because Judge Michonne's not going to be sure whether it's a real event or it's a fake one to short circuit um going oh no he's had a health event um he has to go to his place uh to recover etc etc and then just allowing him to willy-nilly um, uh, go wherever he likes. Does that make sense? There's going to, it's just, it's almost like going to be a precautionary. I think he might be. What are we only looking at? What, three, three weeks, four weeks? Watch this space. Okay, I'm going to leave it there. Um, I don't think the sentencing is going to be delayed, but there are going to be some issues that impact on the actual sentence he gets. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Okay, loved you all. Take care.